GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zila, and we are here today doing the Project Eden scenario. Last episode, we came to this arid planet in hopes of finding Polaris to trade with. So let's check out. We found a Polaris area here. We're going to check out to see what, if anything, we can do here enter lock code oh really yeah poopy really well obviously that's not traitors in there if it's a lock code yeah, I don't see anyone in there to trade with. Okay. Well, this might be a bust. Assembly line. Huh. Am I going to be able to get into any of these and check them out? <clears throat> Sounds like slimes. Am I going to be able to get back up here if I jump down? Is the real problem. What's here? It's one, two blocks. Yeah, I can jump that. I can get a back up here anyway. It's fine. Oh, whoa. What was that? <laughs> nice. Okay. Uh, okay, there's a bunch of guys wandering around here, though. Let's go check it out. Okay, so we can't loot anything by the look of it. Yeah. Oh my goodness, that was a cacophony of noises. Hey, buddy, you're looking a little blue. Clone chamber. Okay. The clone shaver. Oh, man. Gimme, give gimme. Give no. <clears throat> okay. Well, it doesn't look like anyone to trade with. This. <sighs> so these are only going to be useful if you're an enemy of the Polaris, really. Okay. Okay. Well, can't do much there. Let's go check it over here. What a freaking traitor. Security status now in effect. Okay, so how do we get rid of that? Can we look through these? Nope. And what's this? Come on. No? like some manufacturing plant. Come on, come on. Ah, God, there's tons of loot here. Just if you're an enemy of the Polaris, you'd be raking in the loot. Okay, well this doesn't look like we can get anywhere here. No. Nope. Well, this was a bit of a bust. That sucks. It's the point of being friendly with the players if you can't trade with them. They got no traders. I really hope, hope there are traders, players traders, or else it's completely pointless even doing players rep. Just to not get shot, I guess. <sighs> okay, well... Let's head 
There's sure a lot of guns around here, too. Okay, well, there's no traitors. So... That's going to be a major problem. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get CPU upgrade parts. Asset production, yeah, whatever. Yeah, there's... <sighs> we'll take a look at one of these fertilizer plants really quick. I have a feeling there's no traders, though. Well, at least it let us in. Oh. Oh my god! A trader! Nutrient solution, carbon substrate, plant fibers, soil food, stone dust, and fertilizer. Nutrient solution, but he has none. Really? He'll only buy? Ah. Uh, for 10, not worth selling. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> got up here anyone anyone sell me anything besides nothing and that'll change my faction and that's just washrooms yep <sighs> okay Friendly, if I open those. Unfriendly. Okay, well. Pretty freaking lame. One vendor that'll only buy gardening stuff. Okay. Furnaces. We haven't checked that out yet. Constructor, other faction. What did that do? Oh, it turned it on. Huh. Advanced Constructor, other faction. That's cool. Furnace, other faction. Fry all your power. <laughs> Turn the burners on. Um, okay, well, freaking useless. Offices. Oh, I didn't see that. Let's go over there. not going to let's there we go come on players corporation offices good 
Thanks for let me in. Okay, you gonna Okay, buddy. Um else got anything up here no and unfriendly if I open that <sighs> god I'm trying to find freaking vendors to trade with in this scenario is almost impossible I'm not sure if I'm gonna get the gear I need to be able to upgrade past tier two freaking CPUs. That could really suck. Okay, let's check out our solo mission. Investigate colony ship story human human revelations ancient revelations. <clears> hmm. <throat> Make. Yeah, okay. So, human remains. Don't know what that's all about. You get a light laser rifle and laser rifle cell. Polaris. Totally overpowered. Oh, we might be able to do some more of this stuff now. Shut down some of their drones. Power down the zone. Bring back a few samples of Prometheum. Weaponized negotiations. Don't know if we can do any of the Talon stuff here. We're not going to do the Xerax stuff because that'll give us Xerax rep. Okay. Well, other than the resources on this planet, it was a bit of a bust. So I guess that's what we're going to do is we're going to. Wow. <laughs> it's crazy. Um. Yeah, unless I find another area to trade with, we're going to be screwed. Probably just get the Neo. We've got Neo and Prometheum is probably all we're going to go for and then take off then. Okay. Well, I'm going to head over to the Neo patch. Yeah, let's grab some O2. Okay, so we're just going to head back to the Neo, mine that up. There's no Sathium on the planet. Because I don't think... I don't think we can get anything out of these... Uh... Oh, we didn't check the assembly line. It's not going to have vendors. I seriously doubt it. We'll take a quick look. So we've got doors here. buddy any traders in here no just a bunch of suits doing office work wow that sucks okay well <laughs> I will meet you over at the capital vessel. I'm going to go mine up that nail off camera. And I guess we'll go back into space. So I'll see you there. Okay. So we are back in space after mining up a whole bunch of Neo. And look what we found. 
some weird looking pentaxid out just well, I guess we're 5k I spotted it at about uh, 4k out uh, when I was circling around the planet at like 4k and I spotted these things so we're not even close to the asteroid belt okay so um, yeah I'll show you what we got in the way of Neo we ended up with three and a little bit of stacks from mining up two deposits that I had found the one deposit right near the uh, landing spot at the pole and then another one on the way back from the polar zone to that neo deposit to dig it up and i was like well I'll, the one i just found i'll dig up first <laughs> bring that all back and then i went and dug up the one close to the cv and so yeah two really quick and now i'm at this pentax i have no idea how much that's going to be and if we can even dig it up it's white so it doesn't it's not claimed, but it's got like explosive blocks or something in it. See that? It's got cores, and I'm not really sure. It's like, it's going to like take everything out. Like, what the heck? I'm not, I'm not sure. Right? Isn't that weird? Explosive blocks. There's a core right there, though. <sighs> well, let's, for starters, here, we can, um, I don't know if there's going to be any drones or anything. You know what? I'll keep, I'll keep everything running except for the uh, thrusters. I'll just turn the thrusters off for now. Okay, um, you know what, I'm going to have to change out of the, here, let's, let's climb out of the cockpit and change, where's my, because it's too hot outside and too, it's kind of funny, eh, too hot, <laughs> it's out in space, um, okay, so too hot and too ratted okay well what do we got that can battle that we got that for sure uh, can that do oh, protection 40 heat protection it's not going to do it I don't think 40 I think we're going to have to go with that Does that mean heat protection minus two? Like, so it's not as good? <laughs> I'm not really sure. So right now, combined, what are we at? We're at... <sighs> okay, here, let's get rid of this. And we'll get rid of this. Because we know we can't pull it off with the light armor. So. I'm not sure if we can do it with the medium armor. Well, 60 degrees. Yeah, we're really darn close, aren't we? So, 62. 10 rads. We're real close here. Does the armor actually give you... No. Okay, so we can't use that. <clears throat> hmm. Doesn't look like I can pull this off without uh, using the heavy armor. Okay. Well, it's just, although it's like real close, but it's not quite. So let's do the heavy armor. That's disappointing because that's going to make everything suck. So let's get those in there because they don't kill any other stats. They just boost the jetpack, which is good for space and the multi-boost. But we're going to be consuming more food now, which we don't really have a ton of. So it's not the greatest thing. We do got to get a base up and going real quicker. 
it's just let's um I think I want to go out into space can we get a little closer although if we get closer it's probably going to blow up right let's hmm my range 165 oh okay I can get it from here <clears throat> okay so with the heavy armor we're fine we've got oxygen for a bit let's go out and explore this Whew, it's a little creepy out in space just floating around so this is our first space walk really Let's go do this. So if I get too close, I think it's going to blow up. I think I need to just... Let's try shooting the core out. Oh. Bloody recoil. There we go. Okay, so I'm not sure if that's still going to... Well, you know what? We'll sacrifice... We'll sacrifice one of these pentaxes to see what happens if we get too close then, right? Okay, well. Seems okay. Oh, we're still well within range of the uh, CV, so we'll just, uh... Well, let's mine it. Let's connect, make sure we're connected. Uh, we'll just go directly into the container controller that I've got the other pentaxid in. And we'll grab our drill. We'll see how much we can get, how quickly. So we're at 54. Okay. <clears throat> Whoa! Um, okay, that was stupid. <laughs> at least our stuff is right there. I didn't think it was going to blow up. Uh, yeah, we'll spawn there and we'll go get our freaking stuff. Oh, <laughs> uh, rookie mistake, I tell ya. Wow. I haven't died in like forever. <laughs> you know, POI, no, let's go, let's go die while we're mining. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, well, that means we're doing it by drone. <laughs> and yeah, look at it. Look at it. it took out a huge chunk. Uh, I guess I'm going to shoot all of them and blow them up first, right? So I, do I have to worry about me dying again if I go over to this one and get the, get the remnants? Bloody hell. Well, that was the uh, float of shame. Um, wow. <laughs> okay, let's re-equip. Let's re-equip what we got. That, 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 that. And... Yeah, there's... I'm not going to equip. What am I doing? I just want to move stuff up. I want to put that down here. Okay. Fine. It's fine. It's fine. We have more food value now. <laughs> Damn, I think that's the first death. First death. Okay, got me. Got me, Raven. You got me with me being stupid. <laughs> well... I don't know, I just figured the sensor would uh, not work. By shooting out the core, I just, you know, I fell for his sneaky little, put a core here, and they'll think that that by destroying the core, they don't have to worry about the exploding blocks. Well, I'm on to you now, you bastard. You got me. <laughs> well done. Oh, uh, frickin'. Well, hey, I'm getting pentaxed out of this, so I don't care now. And I did recover my stuff, even though, you know, wouldn't have been 
well, actually, I don't, I don't have any kits or nothing. That's true. That that stuff was hard to get. Okay, where, where's the ship? We're getting out of range. Why are we getting out of range? Don't want to get too close to that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, oh, Jip. Eh, we're not getting that much, to tell you the truth. Okay. Well, that, although, I just got five off that. Is that all filled with explosives, too? Huh? See, this one looks... This one looks doable without it exploding on us and killing us. Yeah. Evil bastard. Got me. Got me. Okay. Booby trapped Pentaxid. Gotta love it. And I, I fell for it. I totally, totally fell for it. Hook, line, and sinker. Well done. Well done. <laughs> Oh, yeah, no thrusters. That's not going to work. Let's get... Uh, let's get up here. A little bit closer. There we go. There, you know what? I can probably search my suit oxygen if I just got really freaking close right and then oh actually here let's turn the thrusters off again just to conserve a little bit of fuel oh wait it's not just grinding away at the fuel okay uh, so we've got this one here well I'm gonna take the drone out this time, you know. So then the, the other one with the explosives, we'll just go without the drone and mine that by hand again, you know. Because that'd be the thing to do. Yikes. Oh, we're getting some off this. We're getting some. Huh. Maybe not. Oh, a little bit. It lets us crush stone too, though. Okay, it was 54 to begin with, right? Eh. I haven't got squat. <laughs> eh. Okay, that sucked. Between those two, that was not much. That was not much at all. Basically, just a little bit over double what we had. Okay, well, hey, that's a little over double what we had. All right? Got to be optimistic, I guess. About what we started with. So, warping here, we're not stuck. It's not like we're stuck here. Uh, what we need to do is we need to find a water planet. We desperately need to find a water planet. Um, okay, let's go get this other Pentaxid. How are we going to do it? We're going to do it with this thing. That's what we're going to do. Oh, let me in. Just, just let me in. Oops. Oh, I guess we should have went out the other way. <laughs> That's fine. It's fine. 
It's fine. Just just a scratch. Okay, so this time this time Yeah, 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 I don't care. Here, I'll connect to this one now. I'll connect to the uh, SV container controller. Okay, so that's fine. First, I'm going to start by smashing the core anyway, just because. You know, force a habit. I can't resist a core there. Ooh, I can get single. I can get single ones. I can blow up the sink. Ah, damn. No, I can't. Oh, see, there's sensors floating around in space. Oh, no, that's not a sensor. That's just, I don't know. <laughs> oh, well, I got too close anyway. But hey, this time I didn't die. Okay, I guess we'll mine this up. And figure out where we're going to go on the map. We need to, what is this? Okay, so let's zoom out a bit. Put the moon. Um, here, let's go into the planet info. Put the moon there. It's lava. It's got magnesium, promethium, and pentaxid on it. It's lava. How close are we to the sun? Oh, not too bad. Not too bad. I wonder if this orbit might not be that bad, but... Be nice. Uh, dead. Oh, dead. Dead. That's nice. What else do we have here? Barren. No, arid. Oh, arid. We were just there, right? No. We're on this planet, Pummel Desert. Doesn't have a lot of water, though. But what about this arid one, though? Can we actually get there from here? Where the heck are we on the map? <laughs> Way, way down there. So we'd have to warp back. Wait. Okay. Can I get to... Can you bring me back to there, please? Can, is there a way to warp there? I guess we'll just use the WASDs. It's just a little strange. You know what? Maybe we should do like a uh, no sector, no Saskosium, go cobalt, sathium, asteroid field, space, pirates, mining asteroids, kind of a faction. Is, yeah, okay. So it's a uh, so it's an asteroid field. What about this? So Vernity drones. Active drone swarm detective. This area of Eden is inhospitable. Nice. Um, really? No, it's dead. Can we just go somewhere that's not dead? Another asteroid field. Uh, hard. Pol Sovereignty Polaris. Mining and claim by the pressure of player mining coins put a claim to an owner by us and any mining active will consider an act of progression travels your peers to purchase ore from the mining foreman. Purchase ore is it purchase ore? And we can lock target there. And it's ninety ninety 90 that's like way that's like a lot that's like over it's like like 
just under, or sorry, just under half our pentaxid reserves that we have. Uh, I'm not sure what's in the tank. Not much. So, Jesus. And is and there's no asteroids. That's scary because we could get trapped there. Okay, we can't do that. We don't have enough. Oops. Ugh. This is hard to navigate now. <laughs> okay, we're there. We came from over there. Right? Easy contested. Delvis, what, uh, was barren? Not barren, I don't want a barren moon. Arid, breathable, yes. Plant size four, difficulty two, radiation two, gravity. You know, that sounds not bad. Where the heck did I come from, by the way? That wasn't where I came from. Where did I come from? Crap. I'm lost. A stupid map. Um... Is that all I've uncovered? See, it's hard. I'm gonna like zoom in. That's really slow. That's a little faster using that. Spin around, zoom in. Can we drag it? That's not bad. Dragging it. Radiated, breathable, yes. Um, see, soul brands, dwarf snow starter. That's where we came from. We never went that snow desert oasis, desert oasis. Arid, mire, difficulty hard, breathable, no, that's kind of funny, um, snow, but it had a, it had a station, sovereignty none, See, that might have a trading station, a neutral trading station that we can buy stuff at. Okay. So is there any other trading stations? Packs of Prometheum. Drones hard. I'm not sure if we want to go there. <clears throat> a dead planet anyway. <sighs> what was that again? That was like way the hell. Yeah, that's the one we don't have the the resources to get to and comfortably get home again. Okay, what did I do? This map is driving me nuts. I'm not Not really comfortable with it. It doesn't seem to be fast for starters. Zooming in is a little too slow. Uh, okay. Well, and then it flips around too easy. And all of a sudden I'm like, whoop, where's the, the orientation just flipped on me way too quick with just a tiny little bit of movement. And now I am disorientated okay I wanted to see what the hell was there this is the dead one close to me but that might open something up 
I just don't want to take the 90 that way. That way is fairly expensive, 36. Zascosium gold cobalt sapium. So there's some good stuff there. Zascosium and the gold. It's probably going to be guarded though, right? The Zascosium guarded. So we're going to need a better ship. I just don't know what the CPU limits if we can do it. But, well, guys, I'm going to call it here. Um, I'm going to mine this up. And then I'm going to figure out, I'm going to look at the map and figure out where we need to go next. And um, I really need to find a temperate planet to, to set up a base and some water generators really is what, I mean, I'm going to need to start cooking my water pretty quick for fuel. So, because I'm almost, yeah, I'm getting close to level 20 now. So I'm going to be starting to uh, need to do that. Wow, my heavy armor instantly got destroyed on that that sucked <laughs> i gotta repair it god damn well live and learn <laughs> okay guys well till next episode you guys have yourselves an awesome awesome day